Hi, um, I'm a recovering crackhead. This is my retarded sister <laughs> that I take care of. I'd like some welfare, please. You're a recovering oh crackhead. Oh my god. Yep. And she's mentally retarded. Oh, most definitely. Welcome back, everyone. It's time for another episode of It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Season 2, Episode 3. Let's go. Oh, oh no! <laughs> my daddy's in prison! My daddy used to give hot shots to <laughs> prostitutes! So sorry for me! Oh I got the ground! Dad, you're not even listening to us! Are you really leaving? Yes! Later, bitches! Yeah, have a good life now! Alright, look, I know what you're doing. I could play this game. Mac and me and Charlie can run the bar. Great. Great. Terrific. That's a good oh, idea. We got better things to do. Please, what are you two going to do? Uh, Dee and I have a little something we like to call goals, oh, okay? With weird, aspirations right? outside of this bar. We got big dreams, Mac. I don't know what those aspirations are. Them. You guys have nothing without this bar. Don't worry about us, Mac. We'll be just fine. Dennis and Dee go on well there. <laughs> okay, so I'm assuming they're leaving after the end of the last episode where. He said that either he gave him an ultimatum, either he's part of the gang, he's either part of the gang, or he takes, he sends their asses to jail. And so now this is, they're just, he's part of the gang, technically, but they're leaving. So what are your dreams? Hmm? What are your goals? What are your aspirations? Were you serious yeah. about that? Yeah. What are you doing? So oh, she wasn't. <laughs> unemployment. No, D, that's for deadbeats. Come on, we got a golden opportunity here. You know? We can do anything we want if we put our minds to it. The old Dennis would have said, D, your sad little acting ship so sailed D's a gonna decade be an ago. Actor. It's pathetic. But the new Dennis says that it's not my place to kill your pipe dreams. Oh, look, we're qualified. <laughs> really? How much? 400 a week. 400? That's more than we made at the bar. I know. Oh, in a bar, you're giving me 400 a week? And you split it between we're four people? Yeah. That's what it's there for, right? And in the meantime, we will focus and... Work hard and, and keep our nose to the grindstone. Right? Uh, so I feel like that's not going to happen. One, two, three. We're gonna try and move the pool table. Those things are heavy. <laughs> God what? damn it. Why can you not lift your hand? I don't know, dude. Let me figure out what's, what is happening. Are, are you lifting with your back? Of course I'm lifting with my back, Charlie, okay? But I think your end is just lighter than the balls that roll down to this end. Back. No, you gotta snap your back up and, and lift back. I'm jerking my nope. back up. What do you hey, want hey, from me? What's the ruckus? I'm trying oh to conduct God, important business be back there. We finished over with the tile, and now we're trying to move the pool table back. All right, all right, all right. Have you done the urinal? Because the urinal, you flush it, and it sprays all over the place. Yeah, I know, I know. Look, but bro, you gotta stop bossing us around, okay? I mean, look at Charlie, you're breaking his spirit. Oh, look at me, I'm broken, dude. Look, I'm... <laughs> you guys need a father figure. I don't want a father figure. <laughs> you got oh what I God, need. God, they just... Sitting outside drinking and listening to music. What the hell is this? I thought you two were out looking for careers or something. We are, man. We're just getting a little bit of assistance to help us out over the hump. And this unemployment thing is so great because we've made really big plans. <laughs> I'm going to be a veterinarian. Yeah, and I am going to move to New York. Uh -huh. I'm going to be on Broadway. Mm -hmm. What? It's 1 o'clock in the <laughs> okay. afternoon and you're piss-ass drunk. Well, you know, it's a slow process, man. You know, it takes a little time, but we trust the system. Mm -hmm. Is that a new watch, dude? It is. It's awesome. Oh, and out. I got a Jesus chain. It's good. Oh, All right, look, look guys. Gosh. We want you to I got a bar, Jesus okay? chain. Why in the hell would we do that? You're not even listening to me. Yeah. Did you see my Jesus chain? Busting my ass in that bar. You guys are sitting on the stoop getting drunk all day long? Ooh. Ooh. With this again? With this again? Oh, I have me. no work. <laughs> oh. I don't know how to take advantage of government programs. <laughs> Runs out, all right? And once it does, you guys are going to be back out on your asses. Once it runs out, we're going to go on welfare, yep. dude. Welfare? Oh, my You guys God. can't go on welfare. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. It's reserved for people who need it, you know? Like, poor people mm. who need some help. They're... It's set up. <laughs> they don't care. <laughs> They're going to abuse the system. Charlie, sign here, here, and here. So, you're giving me all your money. Charlie, for the 500th time, I'm not giving it to you. It's not yours. I'm just setting up a temporary account in your name. What my wife can't find, she can't get. Right. This is good. Oh, this is shady, Frank. Money. I like this kind of stuff. Yeah, but you will be handsomely rewarded if you just keep your hands off this money. Right, right. So what's the vig? The vig? Yeah, man. Like, vig? You know, what's, what's the vig on this action here? 
Do you even know what Vig means? Hey oh! What's up, bitches? <laughs> <Nope>. <laughs> Get your gloves. Them. I got a lot of grout work for you to do. Now. Forget the grout. I have been doing a little research that will change our lives forever. Turns out there's a little program called Work for Welfare in which businesses hire potential welfare recipients, the government subsidizes their wage, and the IRS affords thousands of dollars in tax relief. Oh, I don't know what you're saying. Do, is that a question? Charlie. I, I don't understand. What's going on? Oh, don't what? you get it? We will never need Dennis and Dee again. We hire a couple people, pay them nothing, and get them to do all of our work for us. We just pay them nothing. We pay them nothing. That's incredible. It's incredible. What do you think, Frank? Well, if we're going to do something like this, we got to make sure we don't abuse anybody. No, oh my god. I mean, I know it's like to grow up poor, you know. We got to treat people with respect. <laughs> respect is the name of the game. Respect is number There's gonna 1. Be no in respect. Game. <laughs> Absolutely, because we understand the plight of the worker. The plight. Respect. The respect the plight. plight. What do you think, Frank? I'm good. Go get us some slaves. <laughs> oh my god. Go get us some slaves. <laughs> Jesus. No, no, no. What about that one? He seems strong. Look at yeah. those massive thighs. He's, yeah, those are good thighs. Yeah, those but massive you're thighs. gonna have a problem work ethic. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, dude. You can't be saying things. <laughs> no, God. dude, I'm not saying that because he's black. I'm saying he's asleep in his chair. You know, like what <laughs> What about that? Oh, Jesus. that? Well, come I on, knew you were gonna not? do that. That's like reverse affirmative action, dude. You don't want to do that. You could cheat yourself out of a good slave here, man. Why do you know he's not gonna be a good slave? <laughs> cheat Come yourself on. out of a good slave. Look, Look you know what? That. This is so complicated and confusing. And, like, I don't even people. understand. Like, we gotta talk to somebody. They don't even okay, have anyone working for him yet. Hello. Hi. We are here to sign up for the Work for Welfare program. Yeah, my associate and I were just out on the floor, and we're looking for like a suitable candidate. But the problem is, it's really tough to tell just by eyeballing these people. So we're wondering, it, like, do you have like a Facebook yeah. or anything that we can go over like their physical stats and like some kind of numbers, like Excuse weight, me? power? <laughs> Sometimes just expedite the whole process, you know, kind of speedy. It doesn't story. work that way. Yeah. Why don't you read up on some of the program stipulations? Ooh. It's a lot of reading. Big. The Facebook? No, rules and regulations. So. Sort of legal document. Now, is there any way oh, around this? You're right. None whatsoever. Probably okay. not. Yep. All right, well, thank you for your time. We got this, so we'll read it. Have a good one. I'm not reading that. No, I'm not reading this either. Get Frank to do it. Maybe get a slave to do it. Oh, look what oh, this guy dragged to do it. in. Oh, God. Oh, so you've there. decided to steal our welfare idea. Hmm. I can't say I'm surprised. We're not stealing your idea, yeah, okay? okay? All right, let's all recognize this is a little awkward situation between friends at the welfare store. Let's go our mm -hmm. separate ways, okay? You guys can't get welfare. Uh, yeah, we can. No, you can't. They don't give it to any jackass that walks in here. It's reserved for people who need it, okay? That's true, actually. Drug addicts, mentally disabled, people with dependence, Mac, that sort of we've thing. we've got right? it covered, okay? D, your bicycle helmet. Later, boners. Hi. Um, I'm a recovering crackhead. This is my retarded sister <laughs> that I take care of. You're a recovering Oh cracker. my god. Yep. And she's mentally retarded. Oh, most definitely. You have the proper medical paperwork. Medical paperwork? We're gonna need a physician's report to confirm your sister's mental illness and your blood work to confirm your crack addiction. <laughs> well, can't you see how retarded she is? <laughs> Oh my gosh, people have no limits. can't prove that you're retarded. I want that welfare, oh, I Dennis. I love them. You do, so do I. No, you don't understand. I gotta taste in my dream. I can't go back. I gotta get to Broadway, and welfare's the key. What do you wanna do? Oh. <laughs> welfare's the key to Broadway. <laughs> Let's go buy some crack. Oh my gosh, are they actually gonna do crack? So I guess that's how they can prove Dennis's addiction, but how are they gonna prove these... Mental illness. Doctor, and we'll get all of our paperwork, and yeah. we'll get full benefits. And then we'll just collect for just a little while until we get settled, mm -hmm. and then uh, I'll take the MCATs. And I'll move to New York. Perfect. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> wow, you scared us. Oh, not because you're black. What? No, no, no. No, 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 no. We're not no, racist. No, God, no. No, it's just that the neighborhood is scary. If you're another ethnicity, I mean, you, you oh probably yeah. really But, but it's a up. nice neighborhood. I mean, no, it's an okay... The it's the nature of this. They're Roll ridiculous. your window down. What you need? <laughs> uh, one, please. One what? Uh, one, one rock of one crack. One crack. A crack rock. 
Is that enough? Uh, is one crack rock enough? Oh. See, um, I, I don't... How much would you recommend for a first time user? I'll make you a deal. Two for the price of one. Really? Oh, that sounds good. Oh, that's very nice of you. How much? $200? <laughs> I think he's screwing him. Okay. Sounds reasonable. Okay. Great. That should be about $200. Th thanks for being so kind. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pick it up down there. Wait, where? Well, which? This one. It's gotta be that guy. After you're done in the bathroom, you come look for me I'm because I got some boots to be shined. All right, Tony, go chase that leak down in the basement. All right? Okay, boys. It's a boots that need to be shined. He's using it for his own benefit. You. This is brilliant. <clears throat> That's how I roll, Charles. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm going to get nice and drunk, play some video games until my eyes bleed. Amen to that, brother. Me, too. <laughs> I want to play Charlie. Uh, don't you have, like, some stuff yeah. that you need to do? Yeah. No? Yeah, there like was some stuff managerial stuff. No. Managerial stuff. Is no. yeah. I got that all cleared they don't want them around. And then I thought, after we played a video game, uh -huh. the three of us go outside, throw the pigskin around, play some two-hand touch. Ooh, yeah, that's, not gonna, that's not gonna work out. Ooh, well, that's not gonna work out. Mm. Yeah, no, yeah, I already know how to play. Yeah, not, not properly, though. <laughs> right. Uh, oh, Charlie, you know what? We gotta get into the bathroom uh, to show Maria. The Charlie has thing. this thing, she the has scrubbing. scrubbing. Charlie has the scrubbing, the scrubbing thing, thing with the Brillo. I have a bro he has a method. Poor Frank. He just wants someone to spend time with. He's just gonna go pee you while she's just right there. To leave? No, you're good. Just, you know what? Actually, make sure you really work that sponge in there because otherwise, that stain, like, it'll. It's not gonna get clean if you don't. Yeah, it's gonna get. <laughs> Bathroom looks disgusting. Charlie, what are we gonna do? We gotta ditch him or something. I'll tell you what. How about you and me? We go out of the town. You know what I mean? We celebrate this whole situation. I'd love to, Charlie. You know, I really would, but we don't have any money. You know, what are we gonna do? Oh, I got money. Frank's been hiding all of his money in my account. And why was <laughs> I not made aware of this before? Uh, it's got something to do with the VIG. What's a VIG? Well, so you know how big. gangsters, they talk about a VIG? Yeah. And it means... Yeah. Oh, a VIG! A VIG, right. Yeah! Well, so, you should have a VIG. I should have a VIG, right? And Frank didn't give me one. That's bullshit. Mm -hmm. You deserve a VIG. All right, dude, I'm a good guy, You're right? You're a great guy. Yeah, I'm a great guy. I'm all great guys. <laughs> oh, gross. It's so gross, poor lady. Oh, my gosh. Catch. Just a little. Just enough you won't even notice it. Just enough to have a quiet night out. Uh -huh. Let's see. <laughs> oh my god, they're spending all of Frank's money on prostitutes. <laughs> Mac. <laughs> oh my goodness. Dennis! Dennis! What happened? Uh oh, did they smoke the crack? Ooh. Ooh. I'm freezing and I'm sweating. All I want. <laughs> I may have peed in my pants. We missed our doctor's appointment. <laughs> well, only by an hour. We missed our appointment by an hour and a day. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. Maybe if I make a phone call right now, we'll be able to make another appointment. You'll see us on such short notice. We've got to try. Oh hey, my gosh. Thanks for seeing us on such short notice. Oh my god, that's not what I was expecting. <laughs> Okay. So now they're addicted to crack. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. Dennis and Dee are crackheads. Headshots, because you can't have an, an agent without you. Headshots, Dennis, when you become a veterinarian, will you buy me some headshots? Please. <laughs> Dennis. <laughs> oh my god, so they're crackheads. And Charlie and Mac are just living the high life. Hey, Dennis. Dee. Guys. Hey. hey. Hey, how's it going? Good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, really? It's going on all right. Yeah. Oh, putting a couple of things together lately. Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, are you guys holding? Holding what? Do you have any money? Mm -hmm. Please? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, um. I just need a little bit of money. <laughs> Wait, Charlie, get nothing. Oh. <laughs> Driver, we're done here. <laughs> <laughs> They'll just bust out laughing. Oh my gosh, this is fantastic. Enough whining for crying out loud. I think it might be broken. I told you not to act like such a Nancy boy out there. Something was bound to happen. I didn't think it was full contact. <laughs> he doesn't care. Yellow. Hey, this is Pam from First National Bank. Charlie Kelly, please. Yeah, this is Charlie Kelly. Hi, I'd like to speak with you about some recent activity on your new account. Some recent activity on my new account? 
Uh -oh. Calm here, buddy. All right, try it again. No, I've tried it like three times, okay, man? It's just not working. I remind you that the services have already Cut been rendered, off. Charlie. We gotta pay Cut these us girls. Off, Cut us off, Cut us off. Is there a problem? Uh -oh. No. Oh, not a problem no here. Problem. Yeah. I'm calling Hector. Now? No, no, yeah. don't call Hector. I'm uh, calling Wallace. Hey. Mm. We shouldn't be calling Hector or Wallace or any other large pimp. Nope. Uh, Charlie and I <laughs> are gonna handle this situation just like we handle yeah. every situation. We are going. Oh, <laughs> nope, they're just bailing. Peace out. Left the limo there, everything. Let's we'll go back to work for a little while. Just for a little while until we have enough money to buy some more crap. And then we'll go on welfare and I'll go be a star. And then I can be a veterinarian <laughs> of some kind. <laughs> so what delusional. Should about rehab we should hit rehab as soon as possible. Soon. That's a good a idea. Days. Yeah. Not now. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ, that was close. Oh, look who it is. What the hell are you guys doing here? We're getting our jobs back. Yeah, yeah. Uh, can't we, have them. You can't we, have them. We might have a little bit of a drug problem. Oh, either. see, I might not really care. I don't uh, give a shit. Your positions have been filled. Yeah. So we're going to take yours. Uh, no, you're not going to take ours. My dad called and said that, <laughs> that, that, that we could have your job. We need money to pay our hookers, okay? So you can't have them. But we need money to buy crack. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh are you going to get addicted to crack? <laughs> What's all the fighting about? Did you tell them that they could have our jobs? Why don't we go on inside where it's nice and warm and we can settle this like a family? Come yeah, on. what about slaves? They, Not, no, no, no. Slaves are gone. They were bringing me down. Plus, you know they don't <laughs> drink? Drink, I want to drink. I would like to drink. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, stop, second. There are going to be some changes made. Okay. All right, first of all, you two, from now on, are going to do all of Charlie's work. No, 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 no. Charlie's no, work. Not Charlie's not work. Not no, 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 Charlie? You got a lot of balls stealing my money. This shows leadership. I am promoting you to management. All right. That's why I did it. Look at that. That's why I did, that. I, did, why I, did, I, did it. I stole lots of your money. What do I get? You get dick because you are a <laughs> follower and a thief. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Mac. Crackheads, children. <laughs> Crack. 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 <laughs> oh my goodness. That was a great episode. That one was really funny. I feel like every time I watch a new episode in season two, it becomes my new favorite episode. I know I've said this a couple times before that they have no limits on how far they'll go. Dennis and Dee and Joe pretended to be crackheads and mentally retarded. And. Then, when they couldn't prove it, they actually went out and smoked some crack. And now they're actual crackheads. And so I'm one, I'm curious if this is going to be a, a continuous thing throughout the season where they keep falling back into this crack addiction. <laughs> oh my goodness. And then Charlie and, Charlie and Max stole the money, and Charlie's now manager of the bar. Which is going to be a pretty interesting thing to see how that plays out. Knowing how D and Dennis are, I feel like they're just not going to play along with this. I mean, look what they've done already. But fantastic episode. Ready for the next episode. Absolutely love the show. Hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. But until next time, take care.